And hello everyone. This is Masao, which is a game which is made by the same people who made Mad Father. Now, like Mad Father has quite a few similarities, and even some similar characters that you'll find. This game does have sexual scenes though, so if you're not really okay with that stuff, I recommend you back out now. Don't know how bad those sexual scenes are, this is a blind let's play. But still, we'll do what we can. We'll do what we can. Uh, also, the other thing which I will mention, this will be voicing the characters. And a last mention, this is a live stream right now, so if you're watching this on YouTube, this is not be this is there's a reason I'm talking to invisible people you can't see. Because I'm uh, looking at the stream chat and all that. With all that said and done, let's go straight into Masao. Also, if you saw us on YouTube live stream, you might have a little bit idea of what to expect. We call ourselves Aesthetic, because we're gonna be going through the opening again. Masao? Is that you, Masao? Masao! What? Was I dreaming? I thought I heard Masao. I guess it was just a dream. It's been three months. Oh no, it's so late. I'm gonna be late for school. Miss Sao never stood out much, too much in her class. She was just a simple girl, really. I wasn't too close to her, but I was always worrying about Miss Sao being alone. I hoped I could be her friend, but that didn't happen. I asked like again, as I said now twice, how she is monologuing to a fucking coat. Why are you monologuing to a coat, Missy? Three months ago, Miss Sao went missing. She wasn't coming to school, and she hadn't come home either. She's not the type to flee home. Our parents are saying that she might have gotten involved in something. And, again, I must make mention of two things. First of all, I hope she wasn't mis bullied for being called Masao like Masao Soup. And second of all, I like how she just walks over the shoes, doesn't put anything on. She just apparently was sleeping in her outfit, shoes and all, and now she can just leave no problem. Well, I'm off! Our class spread the rumor that Masao was long dead by now. I really hope they're wrong. I want to be your friend. You guys are calling him Igor. Find me. He's a businessman, people, don't you know? For people who don't know what the what I'm talking about, because I'm replying to stream peoples, you'll know in a little bit. So here. And then you have Soda, the attractive teacher of studies class, popular with students for his generosity. And again, he looks creepy as fuck. I don't know what people see in him. Whatever. Mr. Soda's as cool as ever. And there's his official fangirl. That voice I heard in my dream. Was that Masao? You've got some guts to ignore my lecture. Uh, yeah. This information will be essential for the test, so you'd better listen. Uh, y yes, sir. I'm sorry. And then they all start laughing. Yeah, I don't know who's creepier, the teacher or the girl. Maybe they're made for each other. I don't know. Onward. And the bell rings, implying that we can all just stand around and have lunch and talk. Notice how it's supposed to be lunch. And yet, no one's eating anything. We're all anorexic here in the school. Uh, Mr. Soda wears a new suit. Like, whoa, super suave. Ayaka, as they's best friend, a fad following girl who looks up to Mr. Soda. And I have to sit here and question my life to know why she's my best friend. Game, what position she put me in? Ayaka, you've been talking him up all morning. Don't you ever get tired of blabbing? But he's such a ladies' man. He's so nice and smart and the best. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, gotta use some hand cream. Do do do. Did you hear? I did. There's a rumor Mr. Soul had us a hand fetish. Totally attractive. I mean, what? <laughs> Still though. I know! Well, don't you know? Apparently Ayaka knows all about those hand fetishes. 
So maybe if I clean my hands constantly every day all the time, he'll like me more. I don't really care, Ayaka. Why are you my best friend again? Don't really care, she says. Ha! You've got no eye for manners, Teddy. Seriously, what do you see in a seducer like Toma? I, I never said I liked anybody. I just think he's kind of cool, that's all. Really? <laughs> yes, really. Hey, you guys would love to have this guy for a teacher. Now this guy again. There's been some spooky paranormal business going on at this school. I'm getting a little freaked. Paranormal? My ass! Toma, as a classmate, a boy carefree in appearance, personality, everything. I'm for real. It's for real. The other day, a kid in the other class got dragged away in the bathroom. Yoshino, as a classmate, leader of the bullies. There was also the glass in the third floor hallway being broken from outside. Kudo, as a classmate, a calm, early maturing youth. Gotta be ghost! I got a ghost! Going ghost! Yeah! I'm scared! Satomi, a stays classmate, just Atomi for short, Soma's girlfriend. Or Toma's girl, oh boy, as I said again, of course, a steady here would like someone who's taken. <gasps> yeah. Ghost, huh? Dumbass stays! Uh, those ain't exist! Who the fuck says those ain't exist? Anyways, though. Wait, what if this is Messiah's curse? Look, this is no time for jokes. But I mean, it's totally possible. It's been three months since she vanished. Then this stuff just suddenly starts. If those events are Messiah's curse, then Yoshino will be cursed sooner or later. <laughs> Whatever did I do? Yoshino, you did bully Masao a lot. Bullying? Well, I never. I just make a little fun. And Toma's always screwed with Masao. You're the one who'll get cursed. Mate, ha, I'm fine. Masao looked up to me. I wonder. Toma, I'm scared. I mean, I'm your girlfriend. Masao might have a grudge. Don't swear, don't tell me. I'll protect you. Ah, you're so nice, Toma. Pah! Do what are you like, lovebirds? Lol, I DC. I'm trying to see what you guys are saying, but I I forgot how long it was. Masao, please don't curse us. The rest are fair game, though. I know. He'll pr what? Okay, I'm just reading what you guys are saying. So he'll probably protect her and then just run off. He's probably that type of person too. I'm just trying to read the comments that are actually relevant to the chat, which is reminding me stuff. But okay. Oops, did I say that out loud? <laughs> And an earthquake. And it goes dark. What? It got dark right quick. What the heck's going on? Just maybe, just maybe, it really is Masao's curse. Masao's real mad at us. Uh, just shut up. What the hell? I was just kidding about the curse crap. Ah, that's Daddy? No. Masao. Masao. I can hear her speaking to me. Oh, now it's gotta be her. Sh shut it. I don't hear her damn voice. Is that it? You're talking crazy talk. I I'm not. Ah. Masao. Help, 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 help. Find me, find me, find me. Yep, that is quite a demand there. 
And then Waluigi time. Waluigi, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I got that messed up last time. Wog! Okay. And we're almost to the point that we were at last time we were doing this on YouTube. Let's see how this goes. Uh, Masao. Bah. Bah. You finally come to. Uh, where am I? I was just in the classroom. And who are you? I am Onigawera, the student council president, and this is the student council room. And again, you're not fooling anyone, Ogre. We all know it's you. Luckily for you, you've ended up somewhere safe. Ended up? After the earthquake, the school was sucked into another world. This sent those inside flying all across the school. Another world? What's that supposed to mean? And why would that happen? Well, it's a curse. You've seen a lot about curses here. It is the result of a girl's curse that this gir uh, school was sealed in the other world. A curse? It couldn't be. Masao... And then this is a present Onigawara. <laughs> finally made it. I thought I was a goner. So you finally returned, Miss Library. <laughs> uh, she is the school's vice president, always in the library, so that's what we call her. So then, Miss Library, how does it look? As I said, it is Mr. Bald Guy. He is all over the place here. It's messed up and gunked up and funked up. The foundation and everything is wrecked. I haven't been able to find any exits. Plus, evil spirits are going and attacking people. I saw a student killed before my eyes. I'll never be able to eat hamburgers again. Oh, it was frightening. And that's because you put human patties on your buns. Oh, so I see. Thank you for your report. You may retire for now. Yes, well, I'm going back to the library. Call me anytime you need me. And again, apparently they are so nonchalant about all this going on. Students dying. Ah, the council doesn't care. Evil spirits. The curse must have summoned them. The school is now a den of spirits, and there's nowhere to run. And to people who are asking me what the fuck I was saying with the hamburger line, it's a it's a reference to Shadows of the Damned. I will say no more than that. Uh, um. There is only one solution: undoing the girl's curse. There's surely no other way. And because you're right in front of me, I'll ask you to do it instead of doing anything on my own. Oh, you go, girl. Solve the curse before all your classmates die. Can you hear their screams of pain? Can you hear them suffering? It's all your fault. I mean, what? How am I supposed to undo a curse? By saving the girl, uh, by saving the girl's soul, Mrs. Thetty. You must know what it is you have to do. I do. Find me. That is indeed a find me scenario. So I guess we're gonna have to play good old hide and seek. PK, I did upload a video telling you about the stream. It's on YouTube. Masao is calling me, so she wants to be found. Mr. Onigawa, I'll go look for Masao. So you, uh, so you will. As library informs me, the school is full of nothing, is full of evil spirits. And yet you wish to go. I will, because... Masao is my friend. Yes, he's going under a different name, but he acts the same, he talks the same, he looks the same. It's obviously Ogre, so it's made by the same person, too. It's probably just like a nod out. Understood. You're entrusted with the fate of this school. I believe you can do it. If you encounter any trouble, pay a visit to library on the second floor. She will try her best to help. If you wish to make a record, please talk to me. I will do so for you any time. Will you save? Yes, data one. There we go, 15 minutes. Now we can finally play the game. You can press C or Shift to make a quick save. Delete when the game is closed. You can ask library for more details. 
I pray for your safety. He even said that in Mad Father, the, that exact line. And now we can move around. Uh, by the way, the game looks a little bit laggy, but it's not actually like the video. The game just is actually kind of laggy looking. Let's see. It's no use without an item equipped. Okay. Please be wary of spirits. They could be lurking anywhere. What do you want to do? Oh, so I save at you. Alright, so out of here I go. Okay, guys, so we're starting our game. What do you guys say? Do we go to the room to the right, or do we go up the stairs? All these choices and direction, but currently we don't know where anything goes to, so it's just exploration point. So up those magical stairs, or through the doors of magic. Okay, you say the room. We have one person for the room. Right, stairs. Uh, I bet he, he might be the devil, or just... I think he's just a demon, not the actual devil, though. You guys are saying stairs. Stairs. You, you can talk, Blaze. It's okay. No wait doors, right? Okay, uh, door is now starting to win, so go here. Hmm, blood. There's dog print for some reason. A flower pot, nothing out of the ordinary. You're not going to comment there's a picture of a flower there, or dog paws, or whatever the fuck the rest of this is. Nothing out of the ordinary. Uh, how about you? The Principal's Diary. Zuri Zeth Cloudy? Hey, isn't Zuri Zeth that exact same person who was making diary entries in Madfather. Who is, is, is that? What? The emergency exit key fell out of the vase. Somebody pick it up. A vase, it's fixed to the table. Inspect it, inspect. Ow! Got pricked by a rose thorn. Ugh, the rose was poisoned. It courses through Asteti's body. <laughs> Game over. Okay. It's gonna be one of these type of games, is it? Let's quick save. All right. Uh, it's the base. It's fixed the table. Let's destroy it. You can't break it with your bare hands. So I guess we need something to break it with. So we'll come back here when we do not mean to save again, but yeah. I... Let's go over this way. It's going to be one of those games that we die a lot in. So we can't enter into doors that don't have arrows next to them. I guess I'll explore this first out of curiosity. Oh, a student. At least I hope that's a student. It could also be a spirit. I could approach it and it'll turn into a ghost. Watch it happen too. A flower pot. Nothing special about it. It's locked. It's locked. 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 Don't even read the time. Hello, spirit. Aya oh, it's my best friend. Ayaka, thank goodness you're safe. Asteti, you're just in time. Now's the chance of a lifetime. <laughs> Since nobody's around, we're free to look in Mr. Soda's desk. Oh, come on. This is no time for that. Look at what's happening to the school. You're obsessed, lady. Lock, top drawer. Back with love letters to Mr. Soda. Who dares? Who is it who dared to send love letters to my Mr. Soda? Let's find out what they wrote. Ayaka, that really doesn't matter right now. So let's get somewhere safe. No way. I can see everything. And I haven't even looked in the bottom drawer. You, can, you can't pass up the opportunity, but I won't. Fine. What do I care? Honestly, if you're my if you're my best friend, so does desk. Nothing out of the ordinary, nothing here. I love you so much, teacher. I want to wash your underwear. Who? Who sent Mr. Soda this stupid letter? What's this one at the end? From teacher's favorite, Hayaka. Oh. <laughs> of course it'd be you. Okay. Oh, uh, you are... Why are you my best friend? Anyways, though, so onward and outward. Let's go over here. A vending machine. Buy some juice. I do love juice, actually. But they didn't have any coins, and the machine refused to change. What? Adorn these places. 
with all these weird characters. Oh, this is probably a hint for something, so I should probably write it down, but too lazy to at the moment. I also remember the notes here. Alright, so do you guys think I should go... Uh, here's the question. Should I go up these stairs over there? Should I check out these restrooms, or should I go outside these doors? What do you guys think? Yumi! And as I said, it does have a ridiculous build, and it's made by the same person who made Mad Father Yumi, if you saw that. Oh, I did not mean to go outside. What do you guys want to do? What do you guys want to do? Restroom? Let's see. Rest. People are saying the restroom. Okay, men's... Man bathroom? Of course, let's go to the restroom. Female restroom? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. No, Mad Father was not a live stream. I just played that on my lonesome. Okay, we'll go here first. Fire extinguisher. Gross! Don't go into the min. Oh, here we go. We do have some. Ah, stay away! Oh, uh, 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 Tome! Toma! Help! Uh, 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 whoa, Luigi! Yeah, 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 he's a. You guys are right. He's the guy who ran away at the sight of danger. Yeah, you guys called that one a mile away. Toma! No! I have to save her. Need something to drive it away. Dead. I don't have anything to... Fire extinguisher. Perfect! Now I get the evil spirit. I knew that was gonna happen. Satome. How dare you do this to Satome! Take this, monster! Who wants to bet she'll come back as an evil spirit? Who wants to bet that she is going to come back as a white, cloudy evil spirit for her death? Anyways, so onward. I know! She just like fucking falcon punched that spirit with a fire extinguisher. Okay, woman's restroom now. Laughing. Just what I wanted to hear. Out we go. <laughs> kind of creepy. Okay, you guys want to go to the right? Do you guys want to go up? Or you guys want to go up the stairs? All these directions. I'm going to check this out first. Got bat. Oh yay! Fill with water. What's my bat? Item. Oh, this is cool. Apparently, I, oh there we go. Equipped the bat. Don't know what equipping the bat will do, but I have it equipped. Uh, we have a warp parts. I don't know. You guys are saying right stairs up, up. Okay, up is one. This one. So up. This song I think was even using Mad Father. Oh, okay. There's a well we can go down right there. And a temple in front of us. What's this? Satomi's grave. Huh? Huh? But she just died. Why does she have a grave here? Someone's grave? There's no name on it. Someone's grave? There's no name. Oh, uh oh. I have a bad feeling about this. Satomi's grave is already lit up. All right, you guys wanna go inside the shrine or go down the well there? I'll let you guys be the choice here. Down the well or into the shrine? Probably do that, it sounds like three others are gonna die, so. Yeah, don't let those fill up. Probably something bad will happen if those do fill up. I have a pretty bad idea, so shrine. Uh, we only have one vote for the shrine. Uh, Mad Father had multiple endings, so it wouldn't surprise me if this game did. Shrine? Sacrifice the body, or the curse will never end. Nothing happens. Alright, looks like this is also something for later in the game. Thanks for checking out the well. See you later, Miss Yumi. Boulders. 
Oh, thanks for that insightful report of what a boulder. What the fuck? Oh, it's the bat. It's probably the baseball bat. But I was wondering, like, how the fuck is she breaking? It? Oh! Now I can't move. Oh. oh. That surprised me, actually. So, gotta be careful. I did just save. Haha! <laughs> I was about to get out of the way. I'll try one more time. I'll try one more time. And then if this doesn't work, I'm just going to assume I can't go down here right now. Ah, uh, I think you can make it just barely. So I'm gonna ah fuck. I probably can't. I'm determined to try. Fucking stubborn as hell about this. I know. One more go, and then I'm done. Ha! Made it! See? You can make it. Oh, I can't save here, though. So now we have a place downstairs. There's Ryan on the wall. I seek blood. Game saved here. So we need to burn blood here for something, I guess? All right, gotta go fast, apparently. So now we'll climb this up. Looks like we have survival tactics. So it seems like all this stuff is stuff that'll happen later when we make sacrifices. So now, up the stairs or to the right? Up the stairs or to the right, it is up to you guys. I'm also gonna check on her dead body though to make sure it's still there. Yep, you're still there. And your gravestone lit up and everything. Right? Okay, you guys are saying right, so let's go right. Got this first door. Nothing out of the ordinary. Save right now in case anything bad happens. A diagram for human dissection. Creepy and stares right at you. Take a nap? No, 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 no. Nothing out of the ordinary. Hey, you guys think I should take a nap or not? Do you guys think it might be a wise idea to nap here? I just took a nap on accident, I'm saying so. That was a nice nap. <laughs> I'll keep on sleeping. One more time. Hey, these spirits are looking out for us. They just like to watch us sleep, don't you know? I don't know why they let you do that over and over again, but that's okay. If they want to watch me sleep, they can. Now then. Nothing there. No, no. Oh. Why, hello there, Missy. You just enjoy yourself hanging in there. Yoshino. Who's Yoshino? Oh, Yoshino was her! The girly guy. Let's see if we can find him before I look around. Uh, is that he? Woo! Help me! Help her? Okay, you guys think we should help her or don't help? Help or don't help? Help or do not help? Well, we'll see, we'll see. Help? Help? No, don't help. Help, help, okay, help, 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 help. I'm sorry, but. Help. I think it might be a he, but... It, okay, yeah, it's her, because it says she, so as a girl. I'd like to help you, but you're always bullying people. Huh? What about it? Did I just say don't? If you promise not to bully weak people anymore, then I'll be willing to help you. Uh, all right, geez, sure. I won't do it. Now let me get out of here. He's going to come back if you don't hurry. Who? <laughs> He's here! I knew it was going to be someone with a chainsaw. No, if he gets a, if I'm found, I'm done for. Gotta hide somewhere. Where can I hide? Small fit in. Small fit in. Did I really just hide inside his corpse? Please don't notice me. What's that sound? No! Stop! No! 
how I thought about was what would be the place I'd least want to hide in. And thus I got my answer. Looks like the monster's left. Woo, and look, she's all bloody. <laughs> you are, ooh, you're a terrible person. This girl is a straight up terrible person. And is that the thing from Mad Father, the thing inside the castle, the plant? Yuck, I'm covered in blood. Gotta wash myself somewhere. Oops. Totally forgot about saving Yoshi now. <laughs> what? Ah, oh, you're what? You're terrible. Bunch of switches. Press one. Is this gonna screech at me like it does in the first game? Ah, uh, it's gonna probably kill me or something. Nothing happens. A poster ranking the coolest students of 2A. Coolest peeping rank gains. Bruno Goldman, Nikki Verde, Trey. I bet I bet Dollar these are real people that are just being credited for the game's development or something. Anyways, though, our bloody selves. I want to go to sleep all bloody. Alright, there we go. Nothing happened just because we're bloody, but. Gotta go to the little ladies' room. How else are you gonna wash yourself off than by going to the little ladies' room? Apparently not. Men's restroom? I wash myself in the urinal. Sounds like a cool idea after you know what just happened, so yeah. I... Lake in the. You guys say, oh, you're right! I should go to the lake in the well because I'm all bloody! You're right about that. Go down here because I wanted blood. Now I have blood. Let me give you my blood. And thus the blood seeps out over there. Yes. Washed away the blood. And now let's frolic in it. Yay! Blood! Yeah, okay. Then let's go straight into here. Found part of Masao. Ah, we found part of her. Masao, I found you! Obtain Masao's head. Well, good thing we can keep that in our pockets. <laughs> Anyways, this way we go. I think there's something wrong with our main character here. Anyways, though. You know, anyways, let's go over here, so... Can I put the head onto this? Nothing's happening. Where did I put Masao's head? Oh wait, it'd probably be in parts. See, parts. It's parts of Masao, because I found her head. Cool. Anyways, though. Something's up with my main character, it's obvious, but I guess we're going up the stairs now. Also, this became bloody. That was not bloody a second ago, so I think I just filled up the whole school water supply with blood. Also, is there two graves? Yeah, there's two graves now. Yoshino's grave. I wonder what happens if I let everyone die. I wonder if I could have saved the people. 